Foods for Wilderness Survival When you find yourself lost in the wilderness, it is very important to know what types of foods are available for you to consume. Most of your food can be found naturally and come in different varieties such as wild berries, fish and other water foods, insects and bugs, birds, and other large animals. It is very important that you have knowledge about each different type of food source and should be researched and learned about before any type of outdoor trip or adventure. Here is a glance of all the different types of food you can use for survival. Wild berries are one of the easiest and most commonly found food items when you're lost in the woods. Most of the wild berries you will find in the wilderness are edible. However, you need to make sure that you research all the different types of wild berries there are and what they look like so that you make sure you don't consume a berry that could potentially harm you. Wild berries are especially easy to find in the summer months. However, you can still find some wild berries that will grow in the winter time. So make sure that you research and know your berries for food supply when you're lost in the woods. Fish and food from the water can easily be found if they are a source from fresh water in North America or most commonly safe to eat. You can eat fish raw. However, it is advised that you warm and cook the fish from a fire or portable grill. Catching fish does not have to be a hard task to perform at all. Many fish you can catch barehanded. The easiest way to capture a ton of fish is by waiting by where the fish are found swimming by and then pinning them down to the bottom of the stream. Although it sounds difficult, in actuality it is not. You can also catch other animals from the water to consume such as shellfish and crayfish. All of these water animals are safe to eat and can be easily captured to give you the nutrients and energy you need to survive in the woods. Insects and Bugs Two of the safest insects and bugs to eat are grasshoppers and wood grubs. Although they, although they aren't very tasty, they can give you the protein and nutrients you need to provide your body while lost in the woods. These two types of insects can be consumed without cooking. However, if it is possible, it would be better to cook the two. You also want to make sure that you remove the wings and legs from the grasshopper. You can find grasshoppers in grassy areas, and wood grubs can be found in rotten logs. There are a ton of insects and bugs that you can consume if you are trapped in the wilderness. However, it is wise to gain a good knowledge about different types of insects and bugs that you can consume. Not all insects and bugs can be consumed without giving you bodily harm, which is why it is so important that you know what types are safe and which ones are dangerous. Birds. Although it is very hard to capture a bird without a gun, it is possible with rocks. However, survivalists find it much easier to capture a bird from its nest or to capture bird eggs. Capturing bird eggs is one of the top survival food items that someone can get because they are filled with tons of protein that your body needs to give it energy and to survive. You always want to make sure that you cook the eggs before consumption. Never eat eggs raw. Larger, ma larger mammal animals. Although it can be a daunting task to capture a larger animal without any weapons, you can still, however, capture an animal through a trap and then kill them to eat. The easiest way to kill an animal for consumption purposes without the use of a knife or gun is by a rock. Make sure that you, co you cook the animal thoroughly. Although you can consume some large animals raw, it is better to be precautious and cook all of your food that you capture. Although being lost in the woods can be a very scary situation, Making sure that you know the foods that are readily available and surrounding you can alleviate one worry off of your shoulder. Making sure that your body stays hydrated and nourished is very important in your goal to surviving the outdoors. So make sure you keep these tips in mind and use them if you ever become lost in the woods.